Welcome back everyone. I'll go and show you exactly how to factory reset your Galaxy Tab A8 or really any other Galaxy Tab out there. As long as it's running Android 10, 11, or 12, it's pretty much the same exact process. So what you want to start off by doing is you want to hop inside of your settings application. So you want to go inside here and you want to go inside of your setting apps right there. And once you're here, all you have to do is pretty much scroll all the way down until you see about tablet. So all you have to do is go and click on about tablet and most of the time you'll see this little reset option that comes up right there. Now you can find it within these settings. You can also search for reset up here, but typically this is where I go. So you, you can see it takes us straight to general management. So all you have to do is click on general management or you can click on about tablet or whatever. Now here you can go ahead and have a couple of different set options. You can either reset all settings, you can reset network settings, you can reset accessibility settings, or you can factory data reset. Now that factory data reset will delete everything from your device. The reset all settings is not the same thing. So if you click on factory data reset, it'll go ahead and tell you, hey, this is going to delete all this stuff. All of these applications are going to be deleted too, and all of your data within those applications are going to be deleted as well. Now, if you're okay with that, all you have to do is click the reset button and it will pretty much reset everything on your device. And that is really all you have to do as of that point. There's really not much more you have to do and it's as basic as that. Now, let's say you don't want to do that and you didn't want to reset it. All you have to do is go and click back. And at that point, you can just go and hop out and you can go ahead and just, you know, move on with your day. Now the reset will take a couple of minutes. So what I'd recommend doing, so what I'd recommend doing is making sure you're connected to a charger of some sort because that'll end up fixing it for you. But ultimately, that's how you reset your Galaxy Tab A8. If you guys have any other questions or anything like that, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button on me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.